Hey everyone, Sean Chow here from SeanChow.com and today I have an unboxing and review of the CryptoSteel capsule. They claim it's the mother of all backup. Let's see if it is or not. Okay, let's take a look. Peace of mind. All right, so, okay, wow, <laughs> the instruction is, is huge, <laughs> it's like a poster, oh, that is a mother of all backup, now that's, now this, is what I call an instructional poster. That is here. Let, let me zoom out. Let, check that out. That is, yeah, that. Now, that's an instructional poster. Nice. I like it. Okay. Let's see. What else do we have here? Uh, huh. Bunch of crypto steel stickers. Nice. And the instruction on how to put this thing together is on this side. And what is in here is on, on this side. So this here is A, B, C. So these are so all the letters and uh, continuing more letters. And then we see spacer, one, two, the numbers, symbols, and the end fastener. So enough tiles to assemble all your backup C's. And this here, this is the crypto steel capsule itself. Yeah. This is a cylinder and has a little screw here. Comes out. Remember to put fastener. <laughs> So the crypto seal capsule is a mnemonic C backup for your cryptocurrency. When you first get a crypto wallet like this uh, code card here, during the setup process, you will be given 24 C words to write down on a piece of paper. And these 24 C words, they mathematically generate the uh, Bitcoin private keys. And so if anyone gets a hold of this piece of paper, uh, they can steal all your Bitcoin. So it's very, very important to keep this safe. And writing it down on paper uh, isn't very safe, not safe at all. So instead of writing down on paper, uh, what people do is they would write down on metal. And this is a way to do it. Crypto Steel, it offers a metal backup solution uh, similar to the C plate by Code TI. And I did a review of this already. So, but uh, the Crypto Steel capsule solution is a little, is a little bit different. And here is how. Now, your C words are housed inside this capsule, hence the name Crypto Steel Capsule. This capsule is made of 304 stainless steel. It is uh, fireproof up to 2,500 degrees, uh, waterproof, and it, it, it's, a solid, it's a solid piece of steel, right? And good weight to it. So you open it up, and this is what comes out. Uh, a little thing tells you to remove the... <laughs> Don't forget the fastener. So what we do, what you do is uh, these two pieces here. Then using this stuff. So these little tiles, they they correspond to what's on here. So A A to H, I to P, Q to Z, the spacer, the numbers one, zero to nine, a uh, bunch of symbols, and the fastener and the fastener. Once you get your C words, there's your 24 word C word, you basically just assemble the words by uh, taking each and one. Let's say, let's say the first C word is the word law. So you take an L, which is right here, and it's available in both upper and lower case. So it's hard to see, but one side is the upper case and the other side is the lower case. And the lower case is identified with uh, two dots on either side. So, and then, so you take the L and you take the 
A and W and you slide it in here, but you got to put it in backward because if you want to view it, because if you put the L in first, then then you put the A in, you can be you can have W A W A L. So we got to go W first. So I go W, put a W on here. W A and then L. And then the L, which is right here. So you get the L. So that's your first word. And you can, like, it, it won't, probably won't show up on camera, but yeah, if you look at it, I can see you spacing up a lot. I can see L A W. And then you put a spacer. Put in a spacer here. Oops. Yeah, it's a little finicky that uh, the setup, um, once we discover when setting this up, it's uh you need you're gonna need some patience on this you're gonna need some patience so that's a spacer and then you do your next word let's say when we'll just four letters so next word i'll just use when we'll use my name my last my last name chow ch how many again going backward w w W, then O, then an H, then a C, A, B, C, and there you go, C. And then a spacer. So there we have, I've done the first two words, so yeah. You can see the uh, the spacer, each word. And so you do this for all the words. And if you have 12 words, you can spell out all the words. But if you have a 24 word seed, you can only do the first four letters. And that's okay because uh, the first four letter of the uh, Bit39 word list are all you need. You only need the first four letters to recover your wallet. And so if you're 24 word, you could do, you could do uh, four letters each. And that'll get you to right to the point where you can put in the fastener. So after you're done, you just, uh, you put a fastener in and yeah, you put the fastener in and then you, you put this tab over and then you lock it up and then, then they won't fall out. They won't fall out. Mm -hmm. So now you notice that, uh, in addition to having letters upper and lower case, it also has numbers and symbols and stuff. And the reason for that is that not only can you use the crypto steel capsule to store your C word, you can also use it to store passwords, pass phrases, uh, pin codes to get into your wallet. So it, it's it's quite versatile that way. And so after you after you do all twenty four words, so you just uh, basically close the capsule, and then you just put this somewhere secure, uh, wherever you think, in a vault somewhere, hide it somewhere, bury it somewhere. And if you want, you can put a tamper seal on it, maybe wound it up. There's a hole there so you can loop it and maybe wear it as a necklace. I don't know, whatever. <laughs> but this, your crypto, your crypto C words are now protected and safe. So this is what it looked like when it's fully assembled with the fastener on there so it can't fall out. Uh, it's honestly, it was a, an exercise in frustration of trying to assemble this on. First of all, you need to work backward. Instead of going from one to 24 words, you gotta go from 24 to one, because this is, you know, one to 24. And so therefore you got to start with the 24th word and the last, and you gotta put the words in backward, the last letter, and then work your way out this way. Now. If you ever need to access it, basically, instead of taking this apart, uh, they don't recommend you take it apart because if you take it apart and this falls out and there goes all your words, right? So what you do, if you want to ever need to use it again to restore your cryptocurrency, you know, you take it out, of, take it out of the capsule and then you basically just move these, move the spacer and you just, you just read it one letter at a time by just sliding each individual tile out of the way and honestly that is also an ex exercise in frustration it is it is hard to read uh, moving this individual tile 
it's <laughs> it the space it moves the space especially if you're doing 24 words the gap it takes for a letter to see it like uh, in this lighting i can barely read the letter and then the tiles are so tiny and they're so thin trying to go to the next one uh trying to read it yeah yeah i you need you i gonna need good lighting to be able to read it if you have 12 words there'll be a lot more there'll be a lot more gap for you to read the letter so it might be a bit easier with 12 words by 24 words 24 words yeah it, it's tough to read but luckily <laughs> you know luckily these things you only have to do once and hopefully you never actually need to actually use it so it's meant as a storage device so i guess because of that i will forgive you know the the terrible setup or well, the frustrating setup and the uh frustrating needs to we to see the words that's uh yeah frustrating really honestly frustrating but as for keeping the your see words safe yeah this is this will once it's locked up uh, this will be pretty safe like uh, it will it will send fire earthquakes flood the only the only issue i was i see is uh if this thing gets crushed and bent like if, if some meteor hits your house and smacks it and then bends it you won't be able to open it because if you if you look at the way this thing's attached it's attached via a rod so if this gets bent if it gets bent you can no longer turn it all right so the only way to open it would mean that you need to take a hacksaw to hack it open to cut it open but once you cut it open uh the possibility that the tiles may all fall out onto the floor and then yeah, you're kind of hooped you're kind of hooped but what's the odds of a, a meteor hitting your house and bending this thing <laughs> a fire is probably a lot a, a lot greater chance right so uh it has good and bad point but i think the good point outweighs outweighs the bad point if you can go through this if you can go through the uh, frustration of setting it up uh this is okay the other advantage of this compared to say a c plate is that it is reusable but a c plate once you punch in the uh punch in the holes for your c words uh that's it you can't reuse it if you if you punch in the wrong spot you kind of you're kind of screwed as well then they go 60 dollar plate right you gotta buy another one and uh, if you if you create a new wallet or you want to redo your wallet and create a whole new c words you can't use it again you have to buy another c plate that's another 60 bucks with the uh crypto seal capsule because these tiles these tiles are basically they, they just slot into the uh into this rod you can reuse it so if you change your wallet uh you want to create new c words you take this out throw it out and you create a whole new set of c words reusable and that's a good thing because this sucker costs 92 dollars so it's, it's a premium price product but it does feel premium like i said it has a good weight to it and uh it it looks good it feels good and it's the form factor affords a lot more better hiding spot uh when it's in the capsule you can't see the words whereas this you know they can see it's visible the, all, the whole punch the punch and everything is visible so that's better this is all hidden and you could probably have you could probably hide this easier than this like uh i think maybe on your top of your door drill a hole slot this in your door plug it back up and it's in your door and no one will know right so that's uh, that's an example of hiding place and it has a like a, a little hole here so you can wear as a necklace i don't know why but hey it's there right. so uh this is the crypto steel capsule uh set up frustrating reading the uh the tiles if you have a 24 word c also frustrating but security pretty good and it will keep your c words safe and protected and if you want to get over the frustrating setup and uh, and read i think the product is worth it john shop for johnshop.com thank you very much for watching if you enjoyed this video please give me a like and thumbs up uh, subscribe to my channel and i'll see you guys next time